Hi everybody, um, I've just completed um, a canvas and wanted to show everybody. Um, I brought four little mini canvases from the works um, for £2 and really wanted to use um, a lot of my um, metals and flowers and and um, you know gesso it all up and use my micro spray, my glimmer mist and everything. So um, this is what the outcome of it was. I'm really, really pleased with it. The colours in it are amazing. Um, I just love how it turned out. It's. It, I'm really, really pleased with it. So I'll explain to you what I did. Um, first of all, I mod podged over the whole canvas and used some of the white tissue paper that I brought the other day and um, crumpled it all up. You can see the texture. I'm just focusing for you. Um, can see all the texture in the background and um, was really pleased with how it turned out. Um, then I used the, went over it with gesso and I just sprayed, sprayed, sprayed. And the sprays I used was Hula Hoop, really nice green. I also used the Latte. Which I can't find at the minute. I used the latte again, and um, I used the cork as well, and I also used um, this one, which is electric blue as well, which is a really gorgeous colour. So they're the three glimmer mists that I used. Um, I used one of my tiny little pocket watches and added some chain which I thought was really cute because it's got a little butterfly in it as well. Gessoed over the top of it, um, stuck the chain down with glossy accents and then gessoed over the top of that as well. Then I went through my jewellery box, and um, well my jewellery making box, and I found one of these feather charms. I just cut the end off and linked the chain to it. Um, got some of my chipboard, um, it's just old chipboard out of my stash, I can't remember where it's from now. Used the word fly and um, I gessoed over the top and then glimmer misted over it with the cork and gessoed again and then just sort of like rubbed over it with my oh, my bronze acrylic paint um, so I'm knocking everything over now I'll just stand all that up um, and then I used some of the flowers that I got from Hobbycraft. Um, first of all, all I did was um, I just literally I stuck it all down um, and it, it, I wasn't really bothered what colours the flowers were. I just sort of pulled them out of my stash and stuck them down. This is um, a metal flower that I got out of my jewellery making kit. Um, an iron rose, that's an iron rose as well. So is that one and the little ones are as well. That's one of my antique buttons. Um, here's another flower just out of my stash. Um, right behind here, I don't know if you can see, let me see if it will focus, um, is the metal, just here, these little leaves, it's the metal um, ear cuff that I showed you in my, in my stash the other day. Um, the butterflies, what I did was, I don't know if you can see behind there, but I stuck two metal butterflies down flat. Oh, this one moves. Um, just in the background there, if you can see that. And then I wanted them to pop out of the page, so then I just sewed over the top and put some pearl trim down the middle. Um, and again, went over it with the bronze acrylic paint. Um, here is just a little, um, on eBay, I brought some little alarm clock keys and um, just put one in the top hand corner. And then what I did is I literally, I gessoed over the whole top of it, all over the flowers and everything. And then I just sprayed, 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 and then just sort of like rub and buffed with my acrylic paint. Um, was really pleased how it came out. Um, I did my usual, I gessoed around the edges. Um, you can see that and just give it my brush effect because I do love my white gesso brush effect border um, on the end of it and um, this this is how it turned out um, I hope you can see all that gorgeous gorgeous shimmer and the texture I absolutely love I'm so pleased with how this turned out considering it's my first mixed media um, mini canvas um, I'm, I am so so pleased with it I just love the way everything came together and um, it's, it's, I just, I just adore it. So um, thank you everybody for watching. Happy crafting and take care.